Hello lovely people, welcome to my video about carpal tunnel and uh, exercises for the shoulders and opening the chest. My name is Amanjot Kaur and I teach Kundalini Yoga as well as other trainings and so on. You can check me out at www.seemseasy.com I would like to invite you to talk about uh, difficulties that we all uh, been challenged with from just sitting at the computer screen for too long. So I have a lot of uh, problems with my shoulders now that I have to spend a lot of time sitting down in front of PC as well as I started to develop a carpal tunnel in my hand and uh, it's becoming pain painful and I've, I've addressed many of different things and once I started doing exercises specifically addressing that nerve in my arm that's I felt the relief straight away so if you leave it too long obviously that uh, nerve that runs through the middle of your arm and uh, through the middle of your palm it's going to affect your not only your fingers it will affect your arm and it will start affecting your side of your body so you know don't um, leave it far too long um, without any attention okay so very easy exercises first of all stretch the arms in front of you fingers together and bring the palms to right angle to your arm if you can obviously just do as much as you can and imagine that you are pushing against the wall you can try if you can't do it by yourself you can try doing it against the wall okay but you should feel the tense nerves and muscles at the back of your palm. So arms are parallel to the floor and fingers pointing up. So about 15 seconds of this. Okay, good. Now, then in the same position, roll the fingers to the pads of the palm. Don't worry about the thumb and again same angles straight angles everywhere then stretch the fingers up then bend the fingers create another straight angles of your hand and then bring the fingers all the way down and pull the fingers down towards the bottom of your palm okay release very good another good exercise Pulling the fingers onto the arm with the help of the other hand to the count of 15. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. And release. We're going to do that with the other arm. And whilst you're pulling them, take notice that your shoulders are relaxed spine is straight there is no tension in your shoulders or your chest opening the chest keep pulling on the fingers and release very good oh. <laughs> okay next exercise palms down then bring the palm up and pull the thumb towards the arm okay again keep the arm straight shoulders down spine straight also do it to the count of 15 it does kind of it doesn't hurt as such but it's not comfortable okay so that's my sensation but this exercise relieves your her carpal tunnel straight away. Okay, we're gonna do that to the other arm and pulling the thumb towards the elbow to the count of 15 or 10, whatever you can achieve. Breathe through these exercises. 
shoulders are down, no tension in the shoulders and release. Excellent, well done. Okay, we're gonna do another exercise with the arms straight out, okay? And again, bring the fingers up, create the right angle. Fingers together, okay? And now what we're gonna do, we're going to bring, twist the fingers towards the front, bring them back up, twist the fingers back and down, and then front and back and down. Okay, so if you can do it with both, that's great, and you can feel how the muscles are stretching, the nerve is stretching, and also keep the spine straight, keep your uh, chest open and breathe through it. So just a few repetitions just to get that stretch. Great, shake it out. And you can do these exercises as often as you need to. Another good one is just interlace the fingers and roll your wrists. Okay, so we're gonna do last one. Bring the hands in front of your chest, palms down, and curve the fingers into the pads, just like we did before. Okay, fingers into the pads. Don't worry so much about the thumb. And in this position, begin bend, right angle down, right angle up, down and up, down. I can feel it in my elbow when I move, okay? Good, keep going. Just a few repetitions of this. Okay, great. Stretch it out and shake it out. Now, you can do it in the gym, this exercise. You can do it in the bath, especially when your arm is warmer. You can stretch, for so, uh, you can stretch so much better. So it's really up to you. And I hope you be healthy and wealthy and cool. <laughs> Till next time. Thank you. Bye bye.